Claire. And I'm Maggie. And, and we're, we're from, from the Channel 6 too. Welcome to TC Tuesday. Today we are going to be showing you guys how to do a dive car wheel on beam. So let's get started. Some skills to have before attempting your dive car wheel on beam would be a cartwheel, obviously. And you should also have your dive cartwheel on the floor. And you should obviously also have a cartwheel on beam before attempting a dive cartwheel. Next you should try working on your dive cartwheel on a line on the floor. When you're doing the dive cartwheel, it's important that you do an arm circle underneath and then swoop for the dive so that at one point your entire body is in the air. Next try practicing some dive cartwheels on beams that are on the ground. I'm going to be completely honest, I'm in the back and I'm pretty sure I don't even land like one of these because I don't do these that often. But I mean Megan lands a few because these are her skill that she actually does in her routine and I haven't done these in a long time. But I mean I'm trying, so just try to land a few on low beam. Once you're feeling a little more comfortable, you can move it up to high beam and practice a couple cartwheels to warm yourself up before going for the actual skill. But then after that, you just have to kind of go for the skill and kind of go from there to see what you need to correct. Um, we've even included a couple of like falls and stuff to show like how you can correct yourself. One thing is to make sure that you look where your feet need to land because obviously you need to see where you land. And another thing would be make sure you actually dive because if you're doing this in a routine, it has to count as your skill. Moving on to some common mistakes, if you go too far over the beam, that means you probably need to stay more over the top of the beam and go in a straight line. And as for this, make sure when you're landing, you pull your shoulders straight up so that you don't wobble. We really hope that you found these tips helpful and are able to get your dive car wheel on beam and use your mistakes to help you make yourself better when you're doing your dive car wheel because your mistakes are going to be kind of the corrections you need to make. Good luck! If you guys like this video, make sure you give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel down below if you haven't already. And we'll see you on Flipping Friday. Bye! Bye.